Hi, welcome to the second part of uh, this video tutorial on creating user access GUI in Codesis. Let us go to our previous projects and try to make some modifications to get our final designs. Here we are going to minimize these buttons. So we have minimized the buttons. Here we will need to add another two new buttons. One called login and the next one just beside it called log out Then we also need um, to show our username. So we take this text field, this rectangle here, and we also add it here. We also need to change the colors. And if you go here to color, normal state. Here we are going to change this background color to something like black. Yeah, we are there. And then we also need to display some text. That one we need percentage S to display our username. Then we also need uh, some the font color here you also want it to be something like green yeah and then we also need a variables Here we need to call some built-in variable from VZ native control and here we need to get the current username. So that is it and then I think it is okay now for this uh, text field now the next thing that we have to do following this one is to link link this one to the login this page to the GUI and in order to do that one we are going to click in the button then go to configure and here we don't have the user management then we need to set up our user management so here we go to visualization manager then here on the user management then we create the user management here and here you can see that by default we have some users then we go here to change the password to make the login easier we assign it for example uh, one So, and this password also we also change it to one this password too we change it to one <coughs> then we go back again here the lock out time we just want to increase it a bit so that five minutes <coughs> and yeah that is it for now 
that is it for now regarding the user management then we can now go if you go to our design we can see that uh, you also have all these things on the our different pages the new menus are there in our pages but just let it select everything and just try to align them align horizontally yeah to make our design better then now after that one we go to <coughs> If you click again to log in, now you want to log link this one to user manager. You can see the user management come in here. You want to link that one to login. It is selected. Then we want to link this one to out to lock out button. Yeah, that is it. Then we can now go to some uh, to go to operations. Under operations here, you want to add some new buttons, and here you are going to add another new buttons. Here, call change password, and we also want to add the next one. The next button here will be called sorry here manage users. It is called manage users. <coughs> then we want to link again that one to get we here we select change user password and here we are going to go to this one then change manage users <coughs> that is we are almost there then the next thing that uh, we want to do now is um, to customize our navigations here and then what we do now is to select this user and go to crop this button main menu and go to uh, user access okay do you want this one to be operable to everyone yeah you want that one to be available to everyone then come to the plant do we want the plant to be available to everyone no we just want the plant to be yeah it will be only visible here to the service and yeah the plant will be visible to the service yeah and here we want um this operations this operations here will be visible to only visible not visible to this person only visible to the admin and also you'll be visible to the admin only visible to the admin here and service so i hope that that one will be enough and what have you forgotten again i think it is okay now then uh, it is okay then let us rebuild our projects Our project is error free then let's go to the simulations mm. 
<coughs> so if you have saved it then go to our main menu then oh here we have to, sorry you have to go back again and make sure that uh, our simulator is running then in order to do that one here we are going to scan under the device here you can see that it's not there so we scan it it is on everything is on then we can now go to simulations now then lock in one in applications yes Okay, waiting for the connections. Yeah, you can see that everything is there. Everything is there running. Main menu is available to everyone, then this one too. Then now if we log in with the admin, enter the password one, you can see that uh, the operations here plants is available all the menus are available and here administrator is displayed then we can now go to plant main menu and now we can log out now if we log in again as a service technicians You can see that okay here you have the service then operation is also available to the service but the plant is not available to the service only uh, the operations here and the main menu and uh, log out so yeah that is it for this uh, tutorial i hope that you will be able now to create some advanced visualizations with uh by being able to log in and log out and then restrict uh, put some restriction to different pages of your applications and I hope that uh, you like this video tutorial and if you have any issue do not hesitate to drop a comments and also do not forget to subscribe to this channel not to miss the future uh, tutorial see you soon bye